can you apply epoxy outside? This is the question that we have. And the answer is uh, no, you can't apply epoxy outside. So in this presentation, I'm going to show you the solution. And I am going to introduce to you in aliphatic polyurethane, a different type of floor coating. But first, let's talk about epoxy. What happens when epoxy is applied outside? One, it goes yellow. It starts to yellow. For some people, this may not be a problem. However, it also starts to chalk. And this is a huge problem because when epoxy chalks, it falls apart. It turns into little crumbs and pieces and the whole epoxy coating is useless. Therefore, I never give epoxies for outdoors for outdoor supplies. I do not recommend epoxy. However, I do recommend a different type of product. Epoxy-based floor coatings are not UV resistant. Anyone that tells you they are, you should stay away from them. They are not very uh, reliable. The solution is this product here. The name of the product is Ctisopur UV, as in polyurethane UV resistant. Um, and here is a first picture of our product. This was applied on the top of a ship deck. Um, it is a color stable, does not go yellow. It's a very long term resistant to extreme sunshine floor coating. It is a two component aliphatic polyurethane floor coating. And I'm going to stress the aliphatic part because people say polyurethanes can resist in the sunshine. My response is not all polyurethanes are resistant to, U to the UV rays. Aliphatic polyurethanes like this product here is resistant. Here is another problem, another picture of our of this floor coating applied on a terrace. Uh, please note our product is the two components. There are some one component aliphatic floor coatings. Ours, we've made our, prog our product two components and it is much more resistant than other uh, products in the market. Here's another picture. Uh, here inside we've applied epoxy, as you can see inside of the building. On the outside, our customer wanted something and we told him we'll apply UV resistant, um, a UV resistant coating so it will not be damaged by the sun. So to summarize, Ctisopur UV, it's UV resistant, it's tough, but it is elastic, and it is suitable for foot and car traffic. I wouldn't recommend it for very heavy industrial traffic, but for outdoor applications, it is suitable. Here, this is uh, the uh, another picture. This is, we did it outside a Volkswagen um, um, car repair shop. So on the outside, they wanted something that would be resistant to the sun. Inside, we put epoxy. On the outside, we put UV resistant polyurethane. Apply it with a roller, as you can see here. Uh, roller is the best method to apply this product. And we can apply it on terraces, exposed car parks, pool deck areas around pools, as you saw at the beginning of this presentation, roof decks. And also, it can be used as a top coat to our waterproofing product, Anadron 2K. So if you need a top coat above a waterproofing liquid membrane, this is a great product to use. Typically, you will use about 200 microns per coat, but we recommend one coat of primer and two coats of Tizopur to get a good resistant overall thickness. For every coat, expect to consume 250 to 300 grams. And we also suggest you can add some thinner, specific type of thinner that we can tell you, up to 10%. The product is recodable after four to six hours, so it does cure quite quickly. And the best part is after 48 hours, you can actually use it for traffic. So you can actually, it can be applied quite quickly. So, for more information about us, our company, our products, go visit our website, www.ctesis.eu. If you have any questions, email us at the email you see here, uh, and we can provide you more information on the product. And we're happy to ship worldwide, providing there's a minimum quantity involved. Obviously, shipping costs are quite high, so we can't just ship, for example, two buckets of UV-resistant coating across the world. But if you have large quantities, we'd be more than happy to... Uh, help you out. Thank you, very much for, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you'll get all our videos. Thanks again, and if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and please share it.